Are you taking video or a picture? Video. Is that a T or a J? That's a T. <laughs> All right, T's <laughs> with white Vegeta. Yeah, that's right. With or white Piccolo. White, white Piccolo. Piccolo. Oh, I messed it. I messed it up. All right, white Piccolo. Let me make it for light, bro. <laughs> All right, let's check this out. So we got that light and fit omelet or something like that. Fit and trim or I don't know. Fit and trim, called. just That's like right. Brandon. <laughs> How do you know you're at breakfast with a YouTuber? <laughs> Trophy room. What's up guys? So we just got to the Campbell Fitness Gym or the gym that he trains at and we're about to hit some squats. We still didn't take our pre-workout. Brandon's in the bathroom. Um, still digesting. It's super early. Woke up at like 6.30 this morning because it's so damn bright in the room but let's show you guys Brandon's gym. Squat racks, racks on racks on racks, Got the benches, CrossFit lawn action, cardio, door, I think that's about it. And then like a little room on the other side. So yep, gonna start foam rolling. Pre-workout time, white piccolo checking in. Yeah. Yeah. Got that pep test bulk. This is gonna make me look like I lift. Make him jacked and tan. And we're gonna stack that with some new pump for him. Let now, Brandon try it. Now, because you're affiliated with that, what do I get out of this? Just kidding. I'm taking some tier one off his hands. New squat shoes. Ooh, like that colorway. <laughs> <laughs> Matches your bed. Intro workout snacks. Side patch kids. Thank you, girlfriend. She bought those for me for my trip, my long ass bus ride. And thanks to Brandon. That's the ghetto version. Ghetto neon sour gummy worms. Yeah. So right now we're warming up. We're filming a friend squat tutorial. Huh? Do you want me to film you? No, oh, I got this. Okay. Professional. Talk to a YouTube professional hair guy. We're gonna film a Fred Squat tutorial, so make sure you guys check it out in Brandon's channel. Link will be down below. A lot of you guys asked me to do it to this tutorial. I haven't Fred Squat in a while because of my knee, but we're bringing it back. Got a lot of good tips. I wrote down a lot of stuff, so make sure you go check that out. Warming up still. Alright, so tell us what you're doing today, Brandon. So, I'm doing a volume block, so what I have to do is 8 sets of 3 for high bar back squats. <laughs> and I think one of the big things that I've learned over the last couple of weeks, and even years, is when you do these volume blocks, you do anything where it's like a lot of different sets, you gotta drop the intensity, only because I can't keep up with that shit. So, 8 sets of 3, but only at 60% to help my old man knees. So Alright. I'm not gonna do it. Two sets in one? <laughs> so Brandon, tell us, what goes on in your head before you do a lift? 
Jump on there. The serious answer or the unserious answer? The serious answer is don't die. <laughs> but traditionally now what I try to do is just make sure that I'm tight. I think that's the biggest thing to say for any lift. Uh, oh, tight, 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 yeah! Get as tight as possible. Usually the lift's going to go pretty well. Regardless if you're squatting, you're deadlifting, or benching. Things tend to work out pretty well because when you get loose, you start getting sloppy. And no one likes loose sloppy seconds, trust me. <laughs> but then you have more chance of getting hurt or not using the best technique or form. So I think tightness is my number one cue for anything going forward. Nice. How about that? Tight, tight. Doing some jacked and tan work, trying to push downs on this. What is this air pressurized push down machine? Ghetto machine. Ghetto machine? Ghetto. All right, let's try it. <laughs> no. Lighten the air pressure. <laughs> Come on. I like to jerk it. Yeah. The harder, the better, right? Just right. <laughs> Look at them triceps. The only horseshoe I have is my bald head. <laughs> <laughs> He's making them dance. You're making a little guy dance. Yeah. You get bigger. Yeah. <laughs> Testing our vertical leap. What did you should adjust it to? What different marker? What marker is that? Eight feet. Eight feet. So that's the top is eight feet. I think so. I think eight feet starts there. Oh, this first one. I think. All right, let's try it. Are you gonna go after me? That's too low for me. Oh, you can do the top? Easy? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Damn, son. All right, let's see how high I can get. Oh, I missed it. I hurt my butt. Anyways, he got it. <laughs> All right, let me try, let me try. Can I try some? Yeah. All right, let's see how high I can get. That shoe's gonna fall off. I'm not gonna hit that high. You never know. Are we doing a drift from here? Yeah, just straight jump. Hold on. I gotta get you in the whole frame. <laughs> Alright, now stand there and put your hand up so you can see how... That's pretty good, huh? I think so. All right, crazy guy. Uh. Uh. All right, that's it. <laughs> uh. Oh, how's that? Let's work out meal. Yeah, it wraps. Had to do it. Of course. Bring everyone here. <laughs> it's like a whole lot.
Vegeta, what does the scouter say about his power level? It's over 9,000! 